On the way up to Garden Valley, it's easy to see the support rural communities have for firefighters. We treat our volunteers as part-time professionals. Um, we expect that they train X amount of hours. We expect them to respond as professionals. Um, but typically, they don't get the recognition back as volunteers. I mean, they're out in the middle of the night. They got to go to work in the morning first thing. Just telling them thanks is huge. But sometimes firefighters need a little help. And that's what a new local auxiliary team is trying to do. We support the Garden Valley Fire Protection District as an organization that goes out and does fundraising to help support nutritional needs when we have an extended incident like we just had. Because while air support and larger agencies worked on the Highway 55 fire, 10 volunteer firefighters protected local structures for two and a half days in the heat and the smoke. We used a lot of our budget on ice and coolers and getting those items to the scene. Something that makes a big difference for Garden Valley. It's even more prevalent here. The other thing that applies in the smaller areas is generally the budgets are a lot smaller, so having more people that, that put in the effort to help support what we're trying to do is huge for us. Um, I think every department should have an active auxiliary. And anyone can join the auxiliary or help by donating to the cause. Uh, if they have a specific piece of equipment that is outside of their budget, we'll go out and fundraise and help them acquire that equipment. Steve Dent, six on your side.